Camp Canyonwood. Well, hello there. Welcome to Camp Canyonwood. We got cabins. We got a fire. We probably got a canyon. We probably got a wood. I hope you enjoy your stay. Why is it in 720 by 480? What kind of BS is this? God damn. Get some better resolution here. Really nice uh, menu music. I was on my way to camp. This is a true story. Out of respect for the dead, all names have been changed. The rest is told exactly as it occurred. The developers went to camp once. <laughs> Job search, she dot com. Jobs, outdoors, camping, Camp Canyonwood. Like working outdoors? Good for kids. Come work at historic Camp Canyonwood. Looking for new head counselor. Apply. You're hired. Well, that was easy. Ah, I get to make my character. Okay, body hue. Pick my color. Let's be a big pink thing. There you go. Body such. Ooh, and the magenta's going. Okay, let's be about there. I like a light pink, honestly. Beak hue. Okay, it'll be my. Let's try and make it cyan. Around there ish. There we go. Beautiful. Hair. I don't have hair. Where's my hair? Take the hat off. Belly spot. I can't see these things. Oh, size of my eyebrows. Hey, hello. Eye distance. Whoa. Oh, hello. There we go. Oh, God. It's, whoa. Okay, let's just have our beak where it was. Beak. Uh, beak. Beak. About there. There we go. Have a little, little etto battle beak. Body type. Ah. Let's be this shape, because then I can see my hair. And then we'll have... Um, why is this? The colors are weird. <laughs> what goes with pink and blue and cyan? Maybe I'll have cyan as my hair as well. Yeah, it matches my beak. There we go. Not green. There we go. A deep cyan. Beak type. Ah, nice, nice, nice. Okay, I like that one. It's like a duck beak. <laughs> we look amazing. Wait, now I feel like the beak should be red or something. Or like duck colored, like... Like there, maybe? Maybe a bit. A bit there, yeah, okay. Um, Face position. <laughs> <laughs> Character creation is always the best part of any game. Camp Counselor Morph. <laughs> there we go. Welcome, Counselor. If you're reading this, you've recently joined the Camp Canyonwood family. Congratulations. For your first day on the job, report to your camp director as soon as you arrive for training. Good luck. Beautiful. <laughs> Look at my car. Missing. Oh my god, is this the last counselor? Welcome to Camp Canyonwood. These historical campgrounds have been enjoyed by campers since 1893. We hope you enjoy your stay. Look out for the signs like this to learn more about the camp's amazing history. Pluck. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. I'm like an egg. Staff cabins. Who's this? You're late. And on your first day, too. I see I made the right choice hiring you. Well, I got bad news and good news. The bad news is we can't use the camper cabin up north. I guess it's not up to code, according to those pencil pushes. The good news is... You are going to demolish it. It's cheaper than trying to fix it. Take this axe and get going. Chop, chop. 
Equip your tools, use the number keys, and hold E. Okay. Are you a vulture? What, 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 what? Where's that lovely camp music gone? Camp Fact. This is the first camper cabin ever built in Camp Canyonwood. It's a priceless historical monument. Victor T. Vulture specifically requested for it to be maintained after he died. Discover more camp facts through the campgrounds. Okay. Well, things are about to change around here. Taking a while, huh? Run for mosquito. Kind of like don't starve vibes. Maybe. What do you want? A medal? Take these tents and campfire. We need to set up a new camp and quick. Set it up wherever you like. I don't care. So long as it's north of the staff cabins. The adults need their space. Okay. Where to place the new camp? Campgrounds. Catch a bug. No bug net. Right. Cute. Have a little tent here. Can I flip it? No. In that case, I'll put it on this side. And this one here. I want it facing the other way, though. It's annoying me that it's facing the same way as the other ones. That looks all right. <laughs> Took you long enough. If you change your mind and want to relocate for whatever reason, use this sledgehammer. One swing of that takes down any structure. Come to think of it, I should have given this to you earlier. Oh well. Hurry along, grab the kids. They'll be arriving any minute. Bring them to the flagpole. I'll give them my patented welcome. Meet the campers by the bus stop. Press spacebar to tell campers to follow you. Space to disband. <laughs> yeah, hello kids, welcome to Camp Canyonwood. I'm your new camp counsellor. Oh, great. Who's this idiot? What happened to the last one? All right, follow me. Mental high five, that kid said. Ah, uh, mental high five, nerd. Oh, this must be the rest of the staff. Welcome, campers, to Camp Canyonwood. Okay. I'm Vernon, the camp director here. That's Mr. Vernon to you. But with any luck, you won't talk to me anyway. Let me introduce you to our counsellors. This is Wick. They craft tools and whatever else we might need. This is Pam. She does the meal prep around here. This is Catherine, the camp nurse who we're legally obligated to have on staff. And finally, our new head counsellor. This person. He's in charge, don't bother me. Alright, I think that's it. Have fun, stay safe, blah blah, you get the idea. Ah, uh, what are we doing today? Uh, let me find out. Wait right here. I give a heck of a speech, don't I? Go talk to Pam. Okay. Take this bugle in case the brats wander off. You blow that thing and they can hear it from anywhere. Send some packing. Hey, bugle. Blow it. Blow, blow the bugle. I imagine the kids might be hungry by now. Luckily, it appears they came prepared for some good old-fashioned fishing. Why don't you take them out and catch some juicy ones for supper? Feel free to toss them on the grill. Okay, camper activities. When you have active troops, an active troop, press E on interactable objects or spaces until campers perform the activity. Help them catch a fish. All right, kids. 
your first badge is for uh, fishing. So go on. Have fun. Don't f don't fall in. Oh, I have to put each of you in one spot. To earn badges, campers must learn an activity. Campers can learn by seeing you do it or by doing it themselves. Once a camper's learned an activity, they can earn a badge. Okay. Oh, well done, Fernando. You caught a fish. <laughs> what are these kids' names? Elmer, Fernando, Archibald, and Joy. Good job, kids. My pockets are full of fish. Oh, there it is. May as well cook the other ones too. Ah. You smell like fish. Not a compliment. Anyway, now that you and the kids are all set up here, there's a few things I want to discuss. First and foremost, I hired you to make this camp profitable. Parents pay at the end of each summer. But they pay more if their kids earn badges while they're here. The more they learn, the more we earn. So be a team player and get those kids off their butts. Secondly, this isn't the safest camp there is. The little brats get hurt here all the time. So take precaution. Kids who hurt themselves enough will eventually call their parents. Eh, oh, ma'am, take me home. And ask them to leave early. That means refunds. Don't let it happen. Now then, as for your sleeping arrangements, we don't have any, not since the last guy. Out of the kindness of my heart, I'm offering you this sleeping bag. Okay. Camp currently has a reputation problem. Parents will leave reviews for the camp at summer's end, earn positive reviews and increase the camp's reputation. Use your clipboard to keep tabs on the satisfaction rating. <laughs> Joy likes Christmas. Dislikes, Halloween, get out, send them home. Hiking, fishing, digging. Archibald, likes, nothing. Dislikes, nothing. Traits, nothing. Elmer, traits, finds children childish. Likes, storytelling, long stretches of silence. Dislikes, cooked fish, running out of toilet paper. Traits, bland. Fernando, likes, bread. The smell of blank paper. Dislikes bread crust. I like bread, but I don't like the crust. Let's see. It says archery, bug catching, cooking, digging, exploring, fishing, fur picking, foraging, hiking, mining, picking up trash, stargazing, tree chopping. I guess I'm going to place my sleeping bag this way, kids. Um, I guess I'll sleep here and keep an eye on everyone. Counselor sleeping bag. There we go. I'll I'll keep an eye out for bears by the fire there. There we go. Use the campfire to end the day. Oh, I'm not on high five. Wait, wait, wait. Welcome to my camp. We have a ramp if you need it to enter the campsite. It'll be alright, you'll get your badges and stuff. Just don't tell your parents if you hurt yourself. Okay, good night. Oh? This land has a history, good shepherd. You are but one of many to take leadership over its soil and flock. What will you do with this power, shepherd? Restore this historic place to its former glory. Shape it anew in your own grand design. These decisions are yours alone. But fear not. For this will not be the last moon I impart my wisdom upon you. Now sleep soundly, good shepherd. What are you? You're like a cyclops bunny rabbit stag thing. 
Your flock awaits your waking call in the dawn. Oh, wait, you have two eyes now. That was weird. Chew on it if you like. It's meant to be savoured. Make a deal? Exchange three random skill points for an inventory slot. Hmm. It's weird. I have the same dream myself every night. What a quinky dink. Alright. Days left of camp seven. Good morning, good morning. Time to wake up, children. Where's my bloody bugle? Where is my bugle? It's gone. How do I get in my invent? No, pick the milkweed up. My bugle's gone. Wake up. <sighs> oh, you must be the new councillor. Though the councillors change every year. This haunted land remains stagnant. Stagnant. I should use that in my next poem. Okay. Am I, did my bugle actually disappear? Do I have... Oh, a further inventory. I. No? That feels weird that it's gone. Okay. Right, let's wake everyone else up. Wait, that was just you again, Alma. Alma, get out the way. Citizens, greetings. And before you say anything, it is a season right now, so I'm still allowed to say that. It's summer, that's a season. Citizens, greetings. Merry Christmas. It will be Christmas eventually, and I'm not going to be here by then, so... Like, at camp, or of this world? Kind of ominous. You must be the new coach. I'm in the new counselor. Sorry. I'm always in training mode. Gotta keep these biceps big for the ladies. Do you see how big these are? Let me flex. It's like two golf balls in my arms. What you can't see is that I'm also emotionally strong. I'm a real nice kid. And I'm a delight to be with. My nana told me. Okay. Ah! I burnt myself. Hi, Councillor. It smells like dirt out here. Wonder what's with that. Alright, all the kids are awake. Follow me! Guess what we're doing today? We're gonna... Pick flowers. Who wants their flower picking badge? There you go. <laughs> Let's go on a on a, a hike. Ah, oh, look, some litter. Let's keep this place clean, campers. There we go. There's some wildlife. Catch that bug. Does anyone have a net? No. Let's pick some more grass then. So I'm guessing the light bulb filling up is their like badge progress, right? We gotta get you guys some nets. Also feel like we should have had uh, breakfast, you know? Yeah, forage it forage! Forage, children! Get those berries. Campers poop, I'm bored. Hey, listen, we're just getting started, okay? We're easing in. <gasps> is that a sleeping bear or something? Or what is this? <laughs> Run, children! Run! I thought it was a friend. Oh god, it's still coming! 
Yeah, safety, cool. Ah. Uh, uh. No, don't panic, kids. Don't panic. Don't panic. Oh, God, what happened to Archibald? It's fine. Get up. It's my first day. I got you. Follow me. End, just end day for everyone. Wait, where did I put you down? Wait, where are the others? Come on, come on. One of your campers had their energy reach zero. They fall asleep. Keep your campers energized and feed them. Okay. Oh dear. Elma. Oh dear. Right, should we get some food? Follow me, everyone. Breakfast. Come here. Get some breakfast. Ah, oh, what an adventure, eh? That bear was definitely just one of the other staff in a suit. And not, there was never any danger. It was like an escape room, you know? Totally understimulated. Listen, we're cooking breakfast. What do you want? Eat that food. I was here. Eat, eat this fish somehow. Do I give you fish and you eat it? Your energy is good. Okay, so whose energy was bad? Joy, not having any fun. You're exhausted. Aha, so Fernando, here you go. Here's some fish. Do you eat that? Can't think of anything to say. Ah, they did eat it, nice. Oh, there is my horn, you're right. No, don't, ah, who took it? Who took my horn? God right, fishing, fishing progress. Fishing's fun, right, kids? Come on. Everyone pick a spot and fish. There you go. Ah, uh, it's picking the flowers. No, do some fishing. Come on. Fishing right here. Hello there, cute little patootle. Okay, that's really inappropriate. Let's, come on. Fish. Expert fishermen and women and thems. Right, let me just carry on fishing. <laughs> Low on fun. <laughs> what do you mean? It's camp. Fishing is fun. What's more fun than fishing at camp? Seriously. You were just chased by a bear. Was that. Archibald's bullying Elmer. Ah, put Archibald, put Elmer down. He doesn't want that or enjoy it. Stop. That's mean. Ah. Right, everyone follow me. Come on. We'll find something really fun to do. It's a super fun game called Forage the Berries Out of This Bush and Eat Them. These are the special edible berries. I know this because they're here. And we definitely wouldn't have poisonous ones around. Oh, wait, someone's calling me. Uh, amuse yourselves. Do something. Go find... No, go find fun to do. I've got adult things I need to be doing. Uh, chop these trees, all right? There you go. Ah, I don't have an axe. Ah, uh, right. <laughs> oh, where's the person? That wants to speak to me. Who was it? The nurse? No, the crafting person. I'm working on figuring out how to build a fence right now. Okay. I guess it's not as easy as these video tutorials make it look. Going through wood like nobody's business. If you'd be willing to donate some more wood, it'd go to a good cause. A fence cause. Ah, so I have to like buy axes from you to give to them? 
Right. Come on. You will learn by watching. Hello? Hello? What are you doing? Flossing. Uh, learn this dance on Fortnite. Right. Come, come here, please. Ah, uh, put me down. It's, tr it's tree chopping lesson time, okay? No axe. Ah, I have an axe. Here we go. Watch how I chop. You see? <laughs> Isn't this fun? Be sure and tell your parents how fun Camp Canyonwood was. We spent a whole day watching Camp Council Morph chop a tree down. Isn't this exciting? True chopping technique. Thrilling. I thought it would go quicker than this, I'll be honest with you kids. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. No pain, no gain. No reward without effort. Uh, where are you going? Um, how it hurts. This is boring. Okay, just don't go to the bear. What was that? I said, look at me chop this tree down. There we go. Let's see if that was enough wood. Hey, did you cook the fish that you had? Wow. That's like, you get so many stars for using initiative and making food for everyone. Guys, pick up some fish. They learned from me. It's so rewarding. Oh, you need 50. 50 wood. Okay. Where'd the other kid go? Alright, now I need that bugle. Hopefully it's one of you ones that's still here. <laughs> Come on, guys. Who took my bugle? Good prank, okay? But I need it back. There we go. Oh, I'm over here. I was doing some fishing to get everyone some dinner. Okay, that's good of you. We'll join you. Go. I'm so bored I could die. <laughs> Everything just so dramatic. Alright, now, cooking lessons. Oh, I can't, like, tell you to cook, though. Weird. Maybe they just do it on their own. Okay, how's everyone's energy level? Six, ten, ten, ten. Cool, let's uh, go for another walk. Follow me. Archibald's panicked? Why are you panicked? What happened? What did you do? Catch a shark or something? Don't forget to chat with me tomorrow. Okay, how do I calm you down from being panicked, though? Because the tutorial, like, oh, you're being bullied. I see it in the bottom left. Fernando bullying Archibald. Imagine being bullied at camp. God. So mean. I'm exhausted and will pass out soon. Okay. Pick up these sticks. Okay, now, everyone be very quiet because I want to read what it says on the sign by the bear, but we don't want to wake the bear up, okay? This is a lesson in how to be sneaky. Camp Fact, Little Ghost Lake gets its name from a handful of ghostly sightings claimed to have taken place nearby. Some say they've seen a little crying girl, others say they've spotted ghostly miners. And all of them wrong, because there's no such thing as ghosts. Ow, mosquito. Discover more camp facts. Alright. No. Fuck. Why are you panicked? Mosquito attack? Oh, God. Bears are awake? Oh, they wake up at night time, huh? Oh, God. Run! 
Monster! <laughs> Come on, kids! Uh, this is the second time today. I thought you wanted something fun to do. It's more fun than being chased by a bear. Alright. Come on! Oh, God! Being attacked! Wish I could tell them to stay. All right, got you. Come on. Hey, bedtime. Wasn't that a fun day? Another day at Camp Canyon Woods. The bear would eat you if he could, but I was here to protect you after putting you into mortal danger. Good night. Go to bed. Didn't I do good, Mr. Weird Bunny thing? <coughs> Welcome back, Shepard. <coughs> you may not be aware, but I'm something of a deal maker. <coughs> Should you be willing to part with something, <coughs> I may have special offerings in return. Are you curious? <coughs> Let's make a deal. Three skill points for one inventory slot, but I don't have. I mean, no one died. Could have been worse. <laughs> Let's see if I can just wake them up with the horn then. Nice. Good morning. Where is me? Oh, why? Only but a babe left here by its own kin. Ah, uh, you've been working on that poetry, huh? Well, counsellor, there's no activity you can put me in that I won't like. I'm real easy going. Who's the peasy mac and cheese? Pretty sure I got that right. Oh. You know what I love about this place? There's fireflies. I love fireflies. The way they light up at night reminds me of Christmas lights. Ah. Actual bugs are kind of gross, though. So how are you doing for your badge? Like, all the fishing we did? I mean, they're getting there towards fishing and flower picking, and even hiking. It's all that running from a <laughs> from a bear, right? Archibald, what's up with you today? You know, I'm such a buff kid, I can actually pick up a ladle. Yeah, pick one up and put them back down. Okay, this doesn't feel right. I'll come clean. By lady, I mean lady, my dog. In my defense though, she like 30 pound. And she really don't appreciate being put in bathtub. All right, what do you say we finish that fishing badge? Because it doesn't seem to matter what I do, you say it's not fun, so you can get your badges. I will at least teach you something. You must be able to like make fun things. Also, I like don't even have a rod myself, so I should get one of those. Come on, guys, carry on. Fish. Get your badge. I've never been to camp myself. Increased your hiking skill. And a Elmer earned a beginner fishing badge. Nice. Archibald earned beginner fishing. Let's get all four. It's nothing as fun as the as achieving something, kids. I 
we go. Get your badge. One for Fernando. Alright, one more to go. Who was it? Is it Joy we're waiting for? Hey kids, go fishing, get badge. I feel like I'd want the archery badge. There we go. Everyone got their fishing badge. Counselor duties. Help them earn badges, keep them healthy, fed, safe, and happy. Gathering around a campfire is a great way to end the night together. Okay, hiking in a group, chopping trees, bug catching, mining, exploring the wilderness, digging. Campgrounds are filthy. More than usual, even. Bring me some of this trash you pick up and prove you're doing something about it. I might be able to secure some trees for decoration. There you go. Oh, I don't have any, apparently. Well, the kids had it all. They must put it in here. There you go. Uh. To you too. Looks like they just cook for themselves when they get hungry. Little minds of their own. All right, everyone grab some fish. About it. I guess they're getting working on their cooking badge. I want to see what else is happening around here, though. Ah, so this is a dead end. Okay. Those boats. Don't look, uh, boatable. Uh, let's try the other route this time. Hiking. Uh, let's do flower picking whilst we're here. Elma is roughhousing with Archibald. <laughs> Will stop. Stop it! Behave. Come on. We was a rough housing. All right, pick this whilst I show you how to chop a tree again. Ah, uh, you're supposed to feed us. Ah, uh, you're supposed to feed yourselves. You see, that's part part of camp life. I want grilled cheese. No. Grilled fish. I want to try it. I want to try it. Oh, right, okay. Who, who wants to try it? Here you go, Elma. Take my axe. And then chop this tree. Excuse me. Guys, don't crowd. Come on, Elma. We're doing the Fortnite dance. Chop the tree, Elma! Ah, I got a wood chopping badge. Well done. Right, now give me that axe back. This is what you get next time you roughhouse me, Archibald. No. Axes are for chopping trees only, not other children. Right, somebody pick up the wood, please. If the kiddos get hungry, cook some grub, they'll feed themselves. Nice. Oh, sorry. That's not wood. That's a child. Stop crowding me! God damn it! Ah, <sighs> on with the hike. Ooh, a snake. A frog. That's pretty. Pick up some of this rubbish and flowers and stuff. 
Worm River was named as part of an online river naming competition. The winner was Michael Early Bird Matthews. Congratulations, Michael. You're right, it does sort of look like a worm. What a fact. Okay, you wanna try? Here. Yeah. Take the fish from you and give you my axe, and then you can try chopping trees. Nice. You got your badge. Give me the axe back. Who else needs a badge? Chop. Chop the tree. You, Archibald. Come here. Chop it. Can you guys fish whilst we're here? No. <laughs> I'm too bored. All right, well, no badge for you then. Let's go back. I don't know where the other person got to. Energy. Lunchtime, 2 p.m. Excuse me, excuse me. Look out for the snake. I don't know how we're supposed to have them get more fun. Like we're doing camp stuff. Isn't that why you're here? Is that not the fun? food. What about uh, this lady? The cooking lady. If you find any juicy berry bushes, remember the berry bush safety song. Leaves light and round, put it down. Dark and pokey, very tasty. I may not remember the words, but uh, you get the picture. What can we buy? Raw mystery meat, a trash can, bird seed, tasty snack that restores energy, marshmallows. Let's buy some marshmallows. Now that's a fun activity. All right, everyone have a marshmallow. <laughs> Give them the V-Bucks. Uh, does you have a phone? Have games on it? Uh, my mum said I can play Ro Roblox whilst I'm here if I get bored. Everyone has a marshmallow? You got a bandage? Where'd you get that from? Yeah, you get one, and I have one. And then we go to the fire, probably, and... Make it a schmores. Make it a melty marshmallows. Yeah? No, that doesn't seem to do it. Do we grill them? What's in here? Oh, flowers and stuff. Hey, look at that. Melted marshmallow. Doesn't that instantly make you want one? I learned nothing from it, though. Forage. No. More hiking it is. Little 5pm hike. <gasps> the bear's gone. Means you can fish up here now. Strange goo. Hmm. Be 
leave them fishing and get some peace and quiet. More strange gear. <laughs> Snake! Damn, man. Camp sucks. It's really boring. And I got bit by a snake. Oh, what's this? Some honey. No axe. Oh, wait. This is how you get honey. I feel like they're bullying each other for simulation. And, and who am I to interfere, you know? Joy is getting aggressive. Archibald is ready to try earning the wood chopping badge. Ah, okay, so that's how it works. Well, here you go, little buddy. Get your badge. Nice. Now give me the axe back, because none of you can be trusted. One left to get their badge. Laura, thank you so much for 27 months. I appreciate it. Hope you're doing well. Hope you had a great weekend. Thank you. Let's see if we can get them their badge before we uh, pass out. Uh, this camp's an hour. Common Camp Canyonwood hour. <laughs> Listen, kids. I'm trying my best. I'm new too, you know. I don't see you telling me anything to do. Let's go to sleep. How about a story? Welcome to Down to Sleep, kids. This one's called... The Not-So-Jolly Boat. They say before this camp was founded, they used to live a nice young couple over on the other side of the lake. They built a jolly boat that they could use to ride on the water, which the young man planned to make a marriage proposal with. But he never realized that she couldn't swim, nor that the boat, in his haste to build it, had a hole. What was supposed to be a magical evening turned into a night of terror as the boat slowly sunk, bride to be and all. If you listen carefully after dusk, you can still hear not the creaking of trees, but the boards of the old jolly boat. As its ghostly presence rose through the forest, carrying the spirit of the poor woman, eyes still lit up with fear. Good night. Ah, Camp Counselor Morph gave me nightmares. <laughs> I peed myself. 